Police and demonstrators clash on the streets of Suriname today. Demonstrators were calling for President Santoki to resign over poor leadership, increased fuel and cost of living among other issues. The demonstrators attacked the National Assembly and businesses in the city. In some instances, businesses were looted. In a statement, the Santoki-led government said it condemned and reject in the strongest terms what has taken place today in and around the National Assembly. Buildings and spaces of the House of Democracy have been reported to have been violently invaded, causing destruction. Strong action will be taken against those who instructed, carried out and caused these attacks. The government also said that it has established a task force that will locate, apprehend and hand over to the authorities those responsible for the action. According to the statement, the government attaches great importance to fundamental freedoms, including demonstrations and protests, but these must take place in an orderly and peaceful manner. Escalation of illegal actions such as smashing windows, theft and vandalism is not acceptable. The leaders of these protests will also be summoned for questioning, the statement said.